Tiger Woods teed off at the Hero World Challenge on Thursday, marking the start of yet another eagerly anticipated comeback to golf. For the first time in over eight months, 47-year-old Woods returned to the course on Thursday, giving supporters a much-needed look at his game. Playing competitively for the first time since April, Woods made yet another recovery from injury when he teed off at the Hero World Challenge, the limited field PGA Tour event he hosts in the Bahamas. During a windy third round at the undulating Augusta National, Woods made his last appearance at the Masters earlier this year. He struggled through agony due to re-aggravated plantar fasciitis from his 2021 car crash, but the elements forced him to retire. He subsequently had surgery on his ankle. Up until this week, he has maintained a rather quiet profile. Before leaving for round one with longtime friend Justin Thomas at 11.52 a.m. ET on Thursday, Woods held a pre-tournament press conference on Tuesday. The star of the show, Woods, drew a large crowd to the first tee box and then blasted a first drive that went 326 yards down the centre of the fairway. Woods' first birdie fell at the par-5 third hole, even after he had made birdies on the first two. The American demonstrated his superb hands with a clean chip on with 65 feet remaining in the green, then sank the 22-foot putt to get into the red. After making two birdies and two bogeys in the first nine holes, the PGA Tour legend reached the turn at even par. The 15-time major winner's momentum, meanwhile, faltered on the back nine as he battled a double bogey, double bogey, par finish to finish at three over and reach the clubhouse 18th. Woods acknowledged in his pre-tournament press conference on Tuesday that his game was rusty, saying he had no idea what to anticipate when he teed it up for the first time since April. I feel like my game is rusty, Woods said. I'm eager to compete because I haven't played in a long and because my sub talent is fused. Since I haven't done it in a while, I'm as interested as the rest of you to see what transpires. However, I can assure you that I no longer experience the same level of ankle pain as I had at Augusta or before. My ankle is fine, but other portions are bearing the brunt of the strain, so I'm a little more sore elsewhere. Thus, the surgery went well. To save energy and give his body a break before Thursday's main round, Wood only played nine holes on Wednesday. This week, Woods isn't taking a leisurely stroll along the fairways in the Bahamian heat at Albany Golf Club. The icon reaffirmed that he wouldn't participate unless he believed he had a chance to win. I enjoy competing. I adore having fun. I miss hanging out with the guys here. I miss the general humor, the fraternity-like atmosphere, and the companionship here, Woods remarked. But my love of competition is what motivates me. I haven't really realized it yet, but there will come a moment when I will be unable to win. When that time arrives, I'll start to walk. The golf legend angrily replied, Absolutely, when asked if that meant he still thought he could win, which would end his tie with Sam Sneed for the most PGA Tour victories.